So, Ron, you uh, damn near took my breath away when you uh, hauled out a gorgeous stepper and presented it to me without having any idea of whether I wanted such a thing or I could use it and what have you. And uh, yeah, it did sit in my junk box for a while um, with the knowledge that it was a stepper that was uh, far stronger, far more expensive, with much higher resolution than I was used to using. And I didn't quite know what to do with it at the time, but I knew that it would come in useful. And I really want to thank you for thinking of me that way, knowing that this thing that you obviously hauled out of some abandoned CAT scanner, I don't know what, um, would be appreciated by me. It sure was. It took a little while for me to find a use for it. But there it is. This is my father's Stanley number no. 4. It uh, has a serious con... Uh, which one is it now? Convexity in the sole. Which means it's going to be really tough to flatten it by hand. I, I think the convexity will just get more and more pronounced if I try to flatten it by hand. And I don't know if I've got the time and patience to sit it through, but you know what? Your little stepper does. So here it is. What I'm trying to do now is establish a little bit of a concavity in the center. In stages, I'll go to longer and longer strokes with longer and longer pieces of sandpaper. And maybe this will, in the end, give me a flat sole to uh, my father's uh, hand plane. So, uh, thank you. And have a great seasonal festivity, whatever form it takes. Festivus or Hanukkah or Christmas. I don't know what. Bye for me.